All right, guys, Fireham here again. Uh, got another unboxing for y'all. I'm really excited about this one. Uh, I'm almost more excited about it than the previous one I did for y'all. But speaking of which, a quick update, that dipole that I got, I uh, put it up in the attic and the SWR was through the freaking roof. I think it was like a six or seven on channel one and like a freaking eight or nine on uh, channel 40. So any of those of y'all that know about SWR, that wasn't right. Measured it, it was off, uh, off frequency or off length for being resonant. So I did a little tinkering and I got it down to like a three. So I'm heading in the right direction, still working on it. So I'll keep y'all updated there. So as of right now, it's not working, but we'll go, go with it. Um, think about maybe doing a inverted V pattern on it. So that will be able to shorten it up from if it was a normal, just horizontal. So may have to do that, but I keep y'all posted from there. Um, do the unboxing. Uh, this is what I got from Whiskey Rivers Art and Trading Company. Uh, they have a Facebook as, y'all can't see me because of all the light. They got a Facebook group and Instagram. Uh, their Instagram is also, the official council tool dealer but go check them out a bunch of great down home guys um can't get this confounded thing open all right so there we go and let's see i really think y'all are gonna like this project also and i know i got a million projects going on that's everything Throw that aside. Got some paperwork here. Y'all don't want to see that. Y'all want to see prop. Y'all want to see the product. Uh, plus, I don't have much memory on this phone, so kind of have to go quick. So here we go. They got a series of axe handle called a workman's handle, and here we go. And I will say this is probably one of the most beautiful handles I've seen. There's no lacquer on it, no finish, um, like the hardware store, so it's already sanded. Uh, might need a slight touch up, but I really don't think it needs it. it. Comes with your wedge already. This is a 28 inch handle. No. I can't remember if I got a 24 or a 28. I'm absolutely horrible at this. Uh, 28. I got a 28 inch handle here. Um, these are part of their premium series that got rejected as a premium handle. So it is still an excellent handle, so it's not worth throwing away, but it had some minor dings. Like uh, this one, I see there's a couple little small divots here, but nothing to worry about. Got another one here for y'all. This is an 18 inch. And guys, I, I know y'all are watching this at some point, unless it's grain orientation, Dude, I think y'all let this one slip through, but, oh man, these look awesome. Uh, man, I really can't wait to get these things hung. So y'all know, I got them sitting right here. This is one of the axe heads that I'm going to do. And I, eh, it's probably obvious y'all watching, but I'm still not going to tell you. That's one that'll be going on one of the handles. And y'all remember the... Uh, Jekyll and Hyde axe, it broke. So we got that going on a handle as well. So that's it. It wasn't as much as before, but for those of y'all axe junkies who like to watch, maybe you got a kick out of it, maybe you're laughing. Honestly, don't care. It's my axe project. Figure try something new, playing around with it. It's all about just figuring out what works, what doesn't. That's, I mean, let's face it. That's how they get different uh, handle sizes. Someone's like, hey, that doesn't work. I'm gonna make a new one. So, <laughs> playing around, figuring out what works, what doesn't, and trying, got tape on my finger, trying to improve my skill at hanging the axes and just my general craftsmanship with it. So, I know it was a quick one. Apologize for that. I don't have much memory on here, but I hope this is a better quality. I will show you all the finished products when it, when um, I'm done with everything. We'll go out. I'll try to test it. I don't know what I got around uh, the house. So we'll go from there. Hope you all like it. Uh, 
again, check me out on YouTube. Well, you're on YouTube. I'm a moron. My apologies. Like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already and want to see more of this. Follow me on Instagram at fireham underscore kn4 dmm kilo november 4 delta mike mike. Um, check me out on there. I do polls and other little things on there. So follow me on there. And God bless everybody. Take it easy. Peace out.